Hello, welcome to Gamer Girls. Um, this is different. Um, we're doing a little bit of a reaction video. It's literally like uh, eight thirty in the morning right now. I have not had my coffee. Like I'm not at all like <laughs> alert or like ready for the day. I'm like in my office at work. Um, <laughs> so here we are. I literally opened up YouTube and what do I see? Freaking Xenoblade Chronicles X Definitive Edition. Like hello. <laughs> Like, one of my favorite Xenoblade games. Like, if you don't know, like, the lore of the channel, uh, Xenoblade's, like, a big part of, uh, like, I have a lot of Xenoblade, like, trailers and, like, theory videos that, like, did pretty well. So, figured, you know what, let's, let's react to this trailer. Let's see what it's all about. Let's see what's going on. So, I've got it pulled up. We're going to play it, and we're just going to see what happens in the Xenoblade Chronicles X Definitive ed Edition. I am so ready for this. Let's go. I am so hyped for this game. I literally like almost like pooped my pants seeing it in my recommendations. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, we got the classic music. Well, here we are. Not too shabby, huh? <laughs> Mm, mm, mm. Ooh, it still looks kind of like. Why does it still look like so shitty? Like it or not, <laughs> I guess it's on the Nintendo Switch, so that makes sense. Modeled after back on Earth. We call it New Los Angeles. Yes. Welcome to NLA. Mm. Let's go, New LA. Come on. And so it was that another survivor came to join our band of refugees. Yes. Together, we resolved to forge a new way of life. I'm pretty sure this is like almost like one to one, like the exact trailer for the original. It looks so weird. Like, I feel like the Wii U version looked better. Truth is, we were adrift, heading into the unknown. Our native home was gone, swallowed in a shroud of love. Yes, go Lao. And our future was uncertain. We had no idea what fate lay in store for us. Only that we had to keep living. Yeah, I would have to watch the original trailer again, but I feel like this is like almost like one to one, like <laughs> just the original trailer again, which is great. When's it coming out? Give me a date. I want to play it like right now. If it's like out now, I'm going to like, I'm just going to like go over here and just like shit my pants. <laughs> Fancy seeing you here. Are we getting extra content? Oh my God, it's in March. Oh. Oh, that's so far away. Who was that? Who the heck was that? I gotta watch that a little bit again. Okay, we got Lau. Fancy seeing you here. Who is that voice? There's gonna be theory videos about this. Like, this is beyond my scope of, like, <laughs> figuring out voices. Uh, I'm good at understanding, like, storytelling um, aspects of Xenoblade, but voices... I can't do voices. Oh man, the only thing that really kind of bugged me about this was the graphics, which I usually do not care about graphics. But I guess maybe because it's on the Switch, like it's just easier to see everything. Like I'm looking at like the uh, picture of like the town right now, and it's like so blocky and pixelated. Like it feels like it's a Wii game. Like <laughs> like so low res. I'm on, yeah, I'm like on 1080. Like, it's bizarre how low res this looks. Where's that picture of the cat? Oh, oh yeah, like this car, like the cars. Like, you can see the polygons on the cars. The cat, like, I think, like, the texture, like, loads in on the cat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's not amazing. But you know what? I'm still going to play it day one. For sure. Um, I wish they could have done something with the graphics 
I wish, you know, I don't know, maybe Switch 2 comes out and they're going to like port it to Switch 2. It'll be like a dual platform type thing. And that will have a better graphical situation. We'll see what happens. It says March. I would assume there's going to be some type of, you know, announcement for the Switch 2 by then. But eh, I can take or leave the graphics. Like, I'm, I'd have to go back and do, like, a comparison of, like, the original game and uh, this trailer to see, like, kind of, like, what the graphics were like. Because I feel like they were better. But I also haven't played X. And shoot, when did X come out? <laughs> it's going to make me feel old. Xenoblade X came out in 2015. Oh my god, that was almost 10 years ago. That makes me want to vomit. So, I don't know. Maybe it looked okay. Maybe it didn't. I don't know. But I am excited for this game. I'm excited for whatever the heck is going on with like this new content with Lau, because that was just like never explained. I'm here for it. If they do like a Xenoblade 1 style like continuation of the story, I'm going to totally be here for it. I hope they do the um, multiplayer aspect where like you, um, I can't remember exactly what it was, but you like fight certain monsters together and you like, it has like a giant health pool and like you can fight it multiple times and it chips away and it's like total like global health. I thought that was like a really cool mechanic and I've never seen a game do it since. So I'm looking forward to it. This I this is like one of my favorite Xenoblade games. Um, so I am so pumped and I cannot wait for it. Everyone get it. If you don't get it, uh, you're missing out. So uh, thanks for watching this. I don't usually do this, but I uh, <laughs> hope it was worth it. Uh, so see you in the next one for a normal like Let's Play style video with Chris.